Hello, friends in the Episcopal Diocese of North Texas. I send you greetings uh, from all of us here in the Diocese of Texas. We are uh, waiting and so excited uh, for this day uh, and eager to begin our work together um, in a more formal way. Already, our staffs are working together to uh, understand the ministry and mission uh, that we sh will hopefully soon share. And uh, we are also assisting in some of the regular work that's already uh, coming before you and your diocesan officers uh, as just a regular part of your life. So already we've begun to work together and to uh, take on uh, what uh, we believe will be essential for the early days and then for the longer term uh, in our hopeful reunion. Though this is before you today, I do invite you to be prayerful, to have uh, come into this time with a great sense of discernment uh, for what you do uh, on this day is a great thing. Uh, it's an important thing. Uh, it is not to be entered into uh, lightly. Uh, though I will say I've enjoyed my time and uh, we're going to have a good time together uh, regardless of, of whether or not uh, this reunion goes forward. But I have to tell you, I hope it does. And I think from the vote, the overwhelming vote in the Diocese of Texas, you know that my words of promise, my words of hope, my words of endearment and love for you uh, are backed by the people of this diocese who eagerly uh, wait to embrace our brothers, our sisters, our, our siblings, our kin uh, and the days to come. So God's blessing be with you. Uh, God give you a sense of grace and wisdom to speak the truth to one another in love, but also to undertake the solid and good work that we as Episcopalians do when we meet in council. Uh, so uh, my folks, uh, join me in wishing you a very good and blessed day, friends.